Hi Aries, welcome to your bonus reading for the day. I'm going to go ahead and pull cards again and see what's coming up for you. Alright, spirits, angels, guides, please show us what's coming up for Aries. What do they need to see or acknowledge, please? Messages for the zodiac sign of Aries. You might be having an awakening of some kind. So the Emperor and the Hangman. Okay, let's see. Spirit and Angels. Eight of Swords reversed. Okay. You're not so worried about something anymore. Okay. The problem is you're getting information that is not like clear or accurate what is coming in in the future seven of coin reversed five of coin is your current energy or feeling strong powerful feelings yeah, this is like, it's not worth it. I don't want to invest in something. I don't want to give my time, money, or energy to something that is not even true. It's false. So what is the final outcome here? The Queen of Water. Being very compassionate, understanding, listening, So, bottom of the deck is the fool, being set free. Um, so there's something where it's not worth it, clearly. You're like, this is not worth it, and I'm having some wish fulfillment come in. Um, okay, we're getting the repeating cards <clears throat> in the upright. There's something you want or need, and what is the ace of cups somebody has strong powerful feelings the wheel turns what is the five of coin four of swords you aren't feeling like you're getting the information okay what is the queen of water the fool a new beginning and it also came out with a king of cups so there's an energetic match. There's a new beginning or setting yourself free. Being liberated. You're on a new path. What is the six of air underlying? Things get easier. Emperor in the upright. Taking your power back. Defending your position. Five of coin. Something's not enough. Why are you seven of coin here reversed? Okay, queen of water, queen of coin. There's two feminine energies. Uh, we do have the death card coming out. So what is the eight of swords reversed? Eight of swords, okay. Something you were worried about you feeling trapped, isolated, alone, without a solution. What is this king and queen of water? And you got the ten. Ten of pentacles coming into money. What's this four of swords? Ooh, the sun shines on justice and the hierophant. So you could be getting some really good news here about something, a legal matter decided by a court a higher authority. Somebody may have lied. Um, what is five of coin? Oh, let's see. What is five of coin? The star card. Hope will be restored for you. Healing. What is the nine of cups on your mind? Magician. 
manifestation, making things happen. Uh, it could also be um, something about manipulation, somebody maneuvering, manipulating. Uh, you're aware of this, though. Okay, so we're getting here a Two of Cups world and Empress. There's something about a goddess or higher standards. Two of Cups coming into harmony. Why are you getting the star for the Five of Coin? Healing and letting go. Uh, let's see. The Strength card. Courage. Seven of Rods. Standing your ground. Defending your position. And what is the Justice? Seven of Swords. Okay, so there's some kind of deception or lie that you were dealing with. Okay, we have a Two of Cups coming in. Harmony and Balance. The Wheel of Fortune turns. What? Okay, we got the Sun card coming out. Happiness, joy, positive energy. Emperor again. What's the upcoming future position? Justice. You're getting justice for something in your situation. But it, it's like it wasn't easy for you. Six of coin. You're being given money. What is the magician? Two of rods and a page of cups. Last minute energies. What is the high priestess? The secret. The knowing. The quiet. Uh, we have the Hierophant. Something being done the right way. Queen of Pentacles is showing up again. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Feminine. What's coming in with the Ten of Pentacles? King of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or some news or information. Why do you have to fight for something here, Aries? You don't want to give up. You don't want to quit. You think it's worth it. Nine of Wands. Queen of Wands. And also Four of Cups is here. So it's almost like somebody is not doing anything about it. Being lazy. Um, wow. You could be defending yourself against a group or a situation where there's some unnecessary limitations that other people are depending on so it's like a very um it's a group <coughs> or a situation where the people are very controlled there is some deception here too with that Okay, <clears throat> what is justice coming in for, for this liar energy? Eight of Cups, walking away from it towards something else. You're getting a better offer. Ace of Coin. Very nice. I like that a lot. Uh, okay, so I like that a lot for you, Aries. You are taking back your power, which means you're not giving your power away to anybody. You know who you are. And... You can fix yourself something. You possibly will be getting a, a refund or settlement for something that was, was or is decided to be in your favor. Show us here for Aries. The stars aligning. Time is an issue. Money, wealth, prosperity, King of Pentacles, Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo. And we have here the thief. We have a child, something about child or childhood.
We have a man. Uh, we have a rebirth. Okay. A lot of people are talking. There's a lot of discussions going back and forth. The sun shines on this situation. There is some good news here. Ten of Pentacles again. Okay, I'm going to leave it here, Aries. Thank you so much for watching my channel. I'll see you in the next video.